Okay, hey everybody. Just like I said, I finished with this wig. She she got dried in the sun pretty fast. And as you see, she is a different color. I don't know how well it picks up. It almost looks uh, like a blue jean color. I still haven't really cut her. But I, you know, I don't hate her. You know, I like it. I think it's it's kind of cool. It's got like a soft purple tone to it. I don't know. Let me change my lighting and see if it's any different. Ooh. You can kind of see it. Uh, oh, I hope you can see it. It doesn't seem like you can, but if you kind of, you see, it, it's like a purple shimmer in there. Um, it's almost got like a blue tinge throughout in, in some of this. So to me, it kind of gives it like um, the denim look. Still got a little bit of, of the dye left. You know, maybe I'll try it another time. But... Uh, yeah, I think I think the water method is the best way to go. And I think I should have put the whole bottle in there. I didn't put the whole bottle. I put like I've used probably three fourths of the bottle. <laughs> Still trying to figure out how this is gonna go. But anyway, I used about two about three fourths of the bottle to achieve this color. And of course I did it two different methods. This seemed to uh, color a lot better, but like I said, I would uh, use the whole bottle, just put it in there, and maybe half a bottle of blue. Because it seems like it, it needs to take a lot of the dye to achieve a color on this hair. Now, I did try to keep my water hot. It stayed pretty hot. Uh, I don't have a pot. If I had an old pot, I guess I could buy an old pot at uh, Goodwill or something and just use that for, you know, stuff like that. But to dye stuff or dye or non-food items, I should say. And that way I, I could have kept it uh, warm the whole time. That might have been a, a, a factor too. But like I said, I'm not hating it. So now my next step is to kind of cut it because I want to cut all this off. But I'll have to see how to do that because I've never really uh, cut a wig. You know, I've cut the bangs a little bit, you know. and But I've never really changed the whole look of a wig by cutting it. So that's it. Ritz color. I don't know. Denim. Do we call it denim? See, you can kind of see the blue in there. Can't get too close. My eyeballs are still healing. But you see like the blue and then it's like the tinge of purple on top. So I don't know. I'm kind of happy with it. I mean, once I get out in the sun, it might look entirely different. She's coming out to be a cute little wig, I think, you know. I'm having a lot of fun with this. She is still a heavy wig. Uh, I know if I wear her in the summer, unless I go straight from my, my house to an air-conditioned place, <laughs> you know, this head is going to be wet from sweating. And I got to work on her a little bit, you know. But, yep, yeah, I just want to let you know this is the color. I'll stick with this for a while until I see if what else I want to do with it. I'm going to cut her up a little bit, and I'll let you know how that looks. So I'll see you later, alligator. Bye.